very warm Sunday welcome to you. Thank you, Mrs. H. Quite special today, <clears throat> as it's Mothering Sunday. Mother's Day. Well, in the UK it is. I'm not sure if it's everywhere. Because sometimes they're different days, aren't they? But uh, Mothering Sunday. So if you're a mother, and not necessarily of a human child, you could be a cat mother, a dog mother, or whatever, animal mother, uh, happy Mother's Day to any mothers watching. Right, very, very simple, relaxing shave today. Um, and the first ingredient to that uh, sort of um, recipe is this. Good old palm olive classic shave cream. We can still get this in the shops. Uh, we can't get the sticks. That's the bit in there, that lovely colour. This is the um, local pottery to me in, down the road. Um, oh, and the blade. I'll show you the I'll show you the razor first. The chic. Does that show up? Yes, it is chic. Uh, black and gold. Twist to open. Non-adjustable. We're going to use that today. And a blade. If you remember, my blades sent me some samples. My blades. And this is the silver. I think I used the stainless last. And this is the silver. So we got the. So this is the silver, so we're going to try one of these in it today. Double wrapped, that's a good sign. That's a good sign. My blades. Nice blade, the last one. So we'll see how the silver does. And there it is, in the chic. Where vintage meets modern. There you go, that's that. Brush, we're going to go Razor Rock Amici. Today, that one there, synthetic, black, noir knot, very, very soft. And black and red handle. So, without further ado, I'm going to wet the brush. Do you plan on a shave today? If you're like me, bit too much cream there, you know, I'm sure I have. Never mind. As if I'm running short of it. Oh, that's that scent is. Um. Yeah, do you plan on a shave of the day if you are, please? A bit more, just a touch of water. Any plans? Are you taking the, your mother out or your wife if you've got children? Or your partner if you've got children? Was it Friday? It was International Women's Day. And I said, it's International Women's Day every day in this house. <laughs> I won't say what she said. <laughs> right. I think we've uh, peaked to perfection. That'll do. Look at that, beautiful stuff, isn't it? So, we'll wet this face and we'll get going. This is a bit milder than my last shave. Hmm. And then I had a few uh, little nicks there, didn't I? But hopefully we're okay today. This was certainly a classic in this country. 
very classic scent as well as I've said before through many many bathrooms many many years many many years ago okay I will heat up the chic give it a fleek just get on with it okay here we go my blade silver first pass That is nice. First pass, there's a few whiskers on here. I need a haircut, let's get in. It seems my hair's grown quicker this time, somehow. Oh, time's gone, I've forgotten. Do you find that sometimes it doesn't grow, you know, you just it seems, and then you have it cut and then you think, what well, seems a few weeks and it's back to so you can certainly feel the blade it has uh, you can feel its presence I wouldn't say it's aggressive um, it's very efficient but you can feel the blade there you can hear it it's cutting through the whiskers like there's no messing there's no um, It feels very comfortable. As I say, it's very efficient, and it feels. Oh, here we go. Feels nice. So it's ploughed through the chin, which is a good thing because the chin area has a very, because it's rounded as well and hairs are very close, it can be quite a, a tough, tough thing for the old blade here, but no messing. I would say having used the uh, the other one, the stainless, wasn't it? Um, that was a good blade. But in this particular shave, I think I would prefer this blade, the silver. Dare I say, it has the edge on it. <laughs> good slickness, very good slickness. I must have a look when I see this shaving cream in the supermarket next time. I must have a look how much they're charging now because it used to be well a year or two ago it was about two pounds a tube two pounds in British pounds I think but um, as I say with all this uh, everything going up it may have gone up again but uh, I'm not sure cross the growth here we go there is overhang to be aware of on this razor Around the mid aggression again on this razor, there's no um, there's no huge bite to it for me. So 
so it feels a nice clean blade and what I mean by that is it's a uh, there's no there's no uh, juddering there's no um, tugging and it feels good So I'll have to see how um because obviously I reuse them as many times as I can during the weeks and months ahead. I don't just use blades once. lovely slickness on this is amazing you forget really how inexpensive it is and well just how simple to use it is lovely oh meal of the day well in honesty I don't know what I'm doing yet and the reason I say that is I got so many, I got some vegetables, uh, I got different types of meat, which are all sort of spare. So I've used, like there's some lamb, there's some, uh, I'm sure I got some pork there. Um, so I'm going to do probably some sort of stir fry because I got some garlic, I got a bit of ginger, I got a pepper, onion, um, I'm not sure if I've got a leek there actually, or, or a piece of leek against the growth. So I'll just chop them all up and stir fry them, add in the spare meat probably. So it might be a lamb, pork. Stir fry. Maybe it was, oh, that's lovely. With some added chilies, fresh chilies. You can hear that cutting through there. Yeah, so I think, judging by this shave, as I say, the other blade was nice, but I think I prefer the silver blade. Um, and you might say, why is that? Well, this. Well, it's cutting as good as the other one, but it just, it has that feeling for me, it just, it feels uh, that, that bit better. And that might be just this shave, you see, you don't know, do you? Wow, the slickness. That's amazing.
feel like you go on and on. Just make sure. Yeah. Uh, a few pickups if there is any. Three, two, one, pickup time, baby. Then we get the baby from baby. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful things myself sometimes. See how them whiskers there are going astray. The head, I mean that's a. Uh, that's a sign for me. So, any plans a weekend? I've asked you that, I may have asked you that. Oh, it was the mothers, that's not it. any Mothering Day plans, but if you're, if you're not a mother, are you... Maybe nothing to do with Mother's Day. Have you any plans? Chill out. Watch shaving videos. I really appreciate her watching this, as always. Wow, that's lovely now. I could just go on and on. That's lovely. Nothing left. Right, cool water now. Good slick, slickness in your palm on it. There we go. <laughs> that is beautiful. Whew. Lovely coloration, eh? All right, I'm gonna go with some homemade mentholated again, witch hazel. That's that. And then, I thought I'd go with some of this Gabri number five, isn't it? Mambo number five. Gabri Barber Cologne, um, professional Barber Cologne number five. Oh, that's nice, you know. Oh, that's nice. That is nice. And then we're going with the same firm, Gabri Professional um, Aftershave Cream Cologne number three. This one. Don't take them off, Paul, did you, bro? Number three. At the time of buying these, because I wanted to get the matching colognes for each one, but uh, couldn't have had it for some reason. At the time, I'll have to look again. Oh, that's nice. That's not too thick, that. It's easy to put on. Nice scent of that. And that is it. That's it. Good enough to cook dinner, to relax, or to go out. So we've used the Chic. This is the black and gold. Twist to open, non-adjustable razor, lovely razor. Mid-aggression maybe with a feather in it, something like that, just above. 
but standard mid aggression. We've used the My Blades Silver. Um, you can hear the blade because I had whiskers on here on the first pass. You can really hear it cutting. Um, it feels very smooth. Uh, as I say, no tugging. It feels a clean blade from the start because uh, some blades, when they're very sharp, they can feel that sort of tugginess, especially the old feathers, if you remember that. Um, which I don't find now in feathers. I really enjoy a feather blade as a go-to blade, if you like, as a regular blade. But that was lovely. I think I prefer the silver to that stainless myself, in that shave anyway. Um, very smooth, very clean, and feels like it could be used many, many times, which I'll try anyway over the weeks and months. So, uh, yeah, very nice. Enjoyed them blades. Um, I'll put a link to them in the description. So thanks again for sending me the samples, really appreciate that. And then we got we use this ingredient, the Palm Olive Shave Cream, the classic. Beautiful scent, easy to lather, good slickness, works wonders. Then we've used the Anvil Pottery Shave Bowl and the Razor Rock Amici Synthetic Brush. We've used water. And we've used the Gabri number no. five aftershave cologne, sorry, and then the Gabri number no. three, and that's the aftershave cream cologne. Good value for money, that for the size of it. Is it? How much is it? 400 ml, 13 and a half ounces. It's good stuff. Right, get on with it, let them go. Goodness sake, they've got better things to do than listen to you waffling on. Right, <laughs> thanks very much. Thank you very much. Have a great weekend, great shaves if you haven't one. And whatever you're doing today, enjoy it. If you, as I say, if you're a mother of animals or children, have a wonderful day. And I'll see you on Wednesday for the midweek shave. All the best and bye bye.